everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to a wedding guest slash occasion outfits video. So I asked you guys over on Instagram what you wanted to see from me and a few of you said kind of wedding guest outfit inspiration, um, occasion outfits, summer wedding, all that sort of stuff. So I thought that I would just show you a few outfits um, of things that I would wear to maybe a wedding or a special occasion in the summer when the weather is nice. So now that the rules have eased slightly in the UK, there are definitely more weddings to go to. So I have tried to make these outfits as wedding appropriate as possible. Um, I've got a white blazer in here, but the dress underneath it isn't white. I do have a dark brown dress. It looks kind of black on camera, but it is actually dark brown. So that should be okay for a wedding, but I know most people tend to wear sort of lighter colors. A couple of these pieces I bought just because I love them and I would wear them anyway and a few I bought with this kind of wedding guest outfit in mind. So I have five outfits to show you and I'm just going to get straight into the video. So first up we have this blue suit. Now I will show you the pieces separately so you can get a better idea. Both blazer and trousers are from Zara and I just think they're the most gorgeous blue. They are coming up kind of slightly more purpley on camera, but it is kind of a very true baby blue. This blazer is gorgeous. It's kind of long line, um, it's single breasted, really beautiful, lovely quality. It's kind of, it's not thick, but it's definitely not a lightweight blazer. So you are going to be wanting to wear this when it's a little bit cooler, perhaps if you're going to like the evening of a wedding, when maybe the weather isn't kind of 30 degrees and it's pure sunlight. This is such a gorgeous piece. And what I love about this outfit as well is it's so versatile. So I know that I would be wearing this blazer, not just on that specific occasion, but again, for something else, you could wear it more casually with jeans. It's just a versatile piece. The blazer itself, I wear in a size medium and it was 59.99. Now the matching trousers are here. I'll take them off the hanger so you can see them a little better. So these are a really nice kind of loose fitting straight leg trouser. They have a gorgeous fastening at the top, really, really smart. A lovely pleat down the leg as well. And yeah, they're just kind of a straight leg. They're a really nice length as well. They sit just below my ankle, so they look really good with heels. Depending on the kind of look you want to go for, you could pop like a white silk camisole underneath the blazer. Or if you're feeling a little bit more daring, you could just wear the blazer with nothing underneath it. And again, these trousers are so versatile, so of course you don't have to wear the two together. These would look great with a vest top and trainers in the summer as well. And I wear these in a size small and they are 29.99. So I have just paired this suit with a pair of white heels and cream clutch bag, which I think looks really nice. Brightens up the outfit. It also looks really, really nice with black as well. I've equally worn this out to dinner with a black vest top and black heels. I just think this baby blue color is gorgeous. Would also be great for like a gender reveal party or a christening or something like that. Or even maybe to the races if you prefer like a pants suit to a dress. This is a really great affordable versatile set because like I said, you're not just gonna wear it to that one special occasion. You can re-wear it and you know you're gonna get your money's worth. And it's not just gonna be something that you put away in your wardrobe and never get out again. So next up we have this dark brown dress. This again is also from Zara. Are all of these pieces from Zara? No. Um, <laughs> this is just a gorgeous draped satin midi dress. Goes all the way down to my ankles. It's got splits at the side so it's really kind of free flowing and it looks really beautiful when you walk as well. Um, the neckline is lovely. You might want to tape it if you are slightly bigger up top um, but for me it just hangs quite nicely in the right place. I love this gathering as well. It kind of sucks you in um, just above the waist, so it's a really flattering shape. There are adjustable straps as well at the back, which is necessary for me. It's just a gorgeous dress, very flattering, very simple, just so easy to wear. Again, this is something that you could re-wear on a night out for a nice dinner, but dressed up with some nice heels, some gold jewelry, it is going to be appropriate for those slightly nicer occasions as well. I feel like it's really important to have like a satin slip dress in your wardrobe. You always know that they're gonna come in handy. They're obviously perfect for special occasions, but they're also really nice, like I said, for dinners and for those slightly more casual days. They suit so many body shapes as well. It's nice to have something that's a bit longer. And yeah, this dress is super affordable. There are so many of these slip dresses on Zara. Uh, this one was 29.99 and I got it in a size small, but they have brighter colors, pinks, greens, yellows, oranges. There are so many about. This kind of thing would definitely be my go-to 
if I had um, a wedding to go to, which I don't by the way. So I have styled this just with some gold heels and my Louis Vuitton clutch bag, which I really forgot that I had. Um, it's obviously a really evening appropriate bag and the last 18 months I haven't really been out in the evening that much. So it's not got the wear that it deserves, but it is the perfect bag for something like this. It goes so lovely with the brown of this dress. And then obviously I've picked up the gold as well. And I'd probably wear some lovely gold jewelry with it just to finish off the look. This would also be great for like a fancy evening on holiday as well. So next up we have another slip dress, but this one is a mini one. And I just love the pattern on this. I saw this in store, um, it's from Zara by the way. I saw this in store and I loved it, but this string was really frayed and they didn't have another one in my size. So I actually went home and ordered it online it's definitely not the kind of thing that I normally wear. I don't normally go for patterns, but I just thought this was beautiful. I bought it at the same time as I bought the blue blazer as well, because I just thought they would go so nicely together, and they do. I also have a green blazer as well, which I would wear with this. But again, the neckline is super flattering. The back as well is gorgeous. Those really thin straps are so flattering. Yeah, this is just a lovely dress. You could pair this with some really simple strappy heels. I've actually got it paired with my white blazer. This is a blazer that I got from Zara quite a few years ago. Um, they have a very similar one though, so I will leave that linked down below. But if you didn't want to wear white, if it is a wedding and you don't feel comfortable wearing white, then a lovely blue or green blazer would work really, really nicely. Or even maybe like a nude or beige color as well if you wanted to add another color into the mix. I just paired this with some white heels, so I thought the white blazer picked up the colors really nicely and just a nice cream clutch bag to go with the base color of this dress. The dress I wear in a size small and it was only $27.99, so again, super affordable and of course really really versatile this is the kind of dress because it's mini you could wear it on holiday with some flat sandals or you could definitely wear it in this country for a night out it's just a very very wearable dress and the green and blue are so gorgeous definitely the colors of the moment as well green and blue they're so popular this summer next up we have another slip dress this is a very very long floor length slip dress this one is from pretty lavish and i actually got this quite a few months ago with the intention of wearing it to a wedding this summer. But unfortunately, the wedding is not going ahead. So it won't be getting worn yet, but I'm definitely going to keep this in my wardrobe for when an occasion like that arises. The colour, I think, is gorgeous. It's this beautiful beautiful shimmering green. The v-neck line is stunning and the little cup detail here as well is really really flattering. Also obviously has the v at the back as well um, and this is a really beautiful shape. It kind of hugs you in all the right places. It goes in slightly at the waist and then it is floor length so this looks really really good with a pair of high heels. This is from Pretty Lavish which is an amazing place to get these kind of dresses from. They have a whole bridal section full of gorgeous slip dresses like this in different colors. They also have the perfect bridesmaid dresses as well if you're looking for something like that. This is so well made, such amazing quality. It looks like it would have cost hundreds of pounds and is definitely kind of like a wow standout dress. I think anyway, it's gonna look beautiful with a golden tan. And I've also chosen to pair it with some brown accessories. So some brown leather heels and my little brown Jacquemus bag. I just feel like that kind of brings out like the more earthy tones because the green is quite an earthy kind of green and then the browns as well, I just think look beautiful. And again, I will probably accessorize with a little bit of gold jewelry, but yeah, this is stunning. If you know it's going to be a very, very formal wedding or a formal occasion, then this is perfect. And if this color or this shape is not for you, then Pretty Lavish will definitely have something that is. I can't remember the exact price of this dress, but um, I've got it in a size eight and I've had to have it taken in. So I would say size down. Um, because it's quite roomy and finally we have another floral dress I've really picked up the greens and the blues today haven't I um, but they are the only kind of colors that I would wear as you guys know my wardrobe is very very neutral so I would tend to go for white or black which are two colors that really you don't wear that often to weddings so I've tried to step out of my comfort zone a bit and provide you with a few more gorgeous colors um, so this dress is beautiful it's kind of hard to show you as um, it's got a cutout. It's got a cutout by the waist. You'll obviously be able to see it much better on, but it is this beautiful material. And I love this material because it doesn't crease, which is perfect if you're gonna be sat down at a ceremony or you've got a long way to travel because this is not gonna look scruffy when you get there. Whereas something like this slip dress, 
you can already see there are a few creases in it. So it's slightly annoying if you're gonna be, you know, sat down eating and that sort of stuff. Whereas this one just does not crease. But anyway, it's a beautiful, beautiful, long sleeved, flowy, floor length maxi dress. I love the pattern on it. It's this beautiful kind of floral pattern. I don't normally go for florals, but I just thought the shape of this was stunning. It's got an elasticated back as well, so really comfy. And this waist part as well is elasticated. This is actually from Glamify, um, which is a website that I occasionally shop on. It's very, very affordable. They've got some really beautiful different items, very, very colorful pieces as well. But I just saw this on there and I thought that just screams kind of summer wedding to me yeah and i think it's absolutely beautiful the cutout as well just makes it a little bit different gives it a bit of an extra edge i have got this dress in a size i think it's small to medium the sizes they come in um, and it fits me really really nicely it's a really lovely length i've just popped this again with some white heels and a cream clutch bag just to bring out the lighter base color in the dress but yeah it's absolutely stunning really nice and long and flowy if that is more your kind of style and again this is definitely the kind of thing that you could pair with some flat sandals or maybe even trainers and a basket bag for during the day so all of these pieces are super versatile except maybe this one i don't think i'll be pairing that with trainers so that is all the outfits that i have to show you guys i'm sorry there wasn't more um i will probably do maybe another kind of summer dresses edit as well if you do want to see more dresses do let me know in the comments which outfit was your favorite and if you have any other specific video styling ideas for me then I will do my best to get that done for you. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a like. And if you are new to my channel, I would love it if you subscribed. And I will see you all very soon with another video. Bye. Bye.